Wake County is about to get some help with its ambulance shortage. Consumer investigator Steve Sprasia joining us live right now with an update. Steve? Well, it all starts Monday, and it's only for two weeks, but it will help the county deal with what it calls historic numbers of 911 calls, sometimes reaching upwards of 10,000 calls a day. Now, four ambulances from FEMA will supplement Wake County's fleet. Those ambulances will be fully staffed for advanced life support. They'll be here from next Monday until October 25th. They'll help the county fill in gaps in its coverage, which at times leaves the county with no ambulances to respond to calls for short periods of time. Now, a current EMS employee who asked that we not reveal who he is spoke to us about the situation. How bad is the staffing shortage now compared to the way it was a couple of years ago? Much worse. Much worse. Um, I've been in the system for, for several years and I've never seen it be worse. Now, the ambulances were sent here by FEMA after the state requested them. 25 were sent and distributed to other counties. Some counties now don't need that extra help. So Wake County has been allocated four of those FEMA units. The county is still working to figure out how it will integrate them into the system in the next couple of weeks. Coming up at 5, I'll look in depth into the ambulance shortage and what the long-term measures are to try and fix it. Working for you, I'm consumer investigator Steve Sprasia. Steve, thanks. We know that's really important. Yep.